uh, my name is Tina Kazakowski. I'm a professional trainer here at the Muscle Factory in San Antonio, Texas. Um, I've been a trainer, professional uh, personal trainer now for about three and a half years, uh, but I've been in the fitness industry for over a decade. I officially uh, started training about three and a half years ago for a show. So basically what happened is I walked into this facility and I knew that I wanted to compete. And this was before competing was a very popular uh, sport. Not a lot of people were doing it. And uh, I decided one day that I really wanted to do a show. So I walked into this facility at the Muscle Factory and uh, I hired my uh, coach and the owner of the Muscle Factory, Roland Gonzalez, to get me ready for my first competition. Uh, about seven months later, uh, I did my first show and uh, I was in bikini and figure I competed in both. And this is how it came out. So this was my first show and after that, I was just a competitor, but then I decided uh, that I really loved the sport and I loved um, training hard. I loved uh, connecting with other athletes and that type of thing. And I just decided to start taking on clients. Uh, my mentor here, uh, Roland Gonzalez, the owner, uh, he taught me every, pretty much everything I knew, encouraged me to get started. And then from there, it just blossomed into uh, my own business. So I specialize in training women. Um, I, there are two parts to that. I train women to compete in either bikini and figure, but I also train women who are just regular people that want to get in really good shape. So I also, I do train men, but I really specialize in, in training women and getting them ready to get on stage. I've been pretty successful. I've been at this for about uh, three and a half years. I've trained uh, MMA fighters and boxers. Um, all of my clients have either won their fights, earned, uh, won their title fight. Um, I recently had one, my latest client, she's nationally qualified. She placed first in two divisions, and so next year she'll be uh, competing to go pro. So I not only do the workouts, but I also provide them with a meal plan that's customized for them. So if they have any food allergies or any food preferences, I try to modify my food plans um, and my meal plans in that way. I also provide them with a cardio and workout guide. So my clients know after training with me for a while, they know how to use the machines, how to use it for their bodies, and uh, what I expect from them when they go home and they have to eat dinner and that type of thing. So it's, it's A to Z. My goals and plans for the future, right now I'm focusing on my clients, um, particularly my competitor clients. Like I said, I had one who placed first uh, twice this weekend and she's going to compete to go pro. I really want to make sure I do a really great job for her and hopefully we can turn her pro. The training is more intense. Uh, my classes are about 25 to 30 minutes and they are every exercise that I do is modified for everyone's level. Sometimes we have people who come in and they haven't worked out for a while. Um, and then I have some people who are a little bit more advanced. So uh, again, the group classes are short, they're intense, but they're also different levels. Personal training is uh, obviously one-on-one. -on -one, so I really focus on that one individual person. It's, um, the pace is a little bit different, the sessions are longer, but uh, we can have that great one-on-one -on -one connection and have more conversations throughout the session. How do I prepare? Um, when I'm training, so I used to compete, I've done four different shows, and I am very intense. So it's very disciplined. Um, I, am, I used to be in the military, so I take a very disciplined approach. Um, and I also apply that approach to my clients. So while we have a great personal relationship, I do require a lot of dedication. Um, I'm very strict, um, but I'm also very supportive. So there's a good balance between uh, getting the work done and doing what you need to do, but also the support on the back end. Competing is a very emotional process. Um, it's hard, you're dieting, you're working out hard, um, but I'm always there for my clients uh, when they need that extra motivation, but also that extra kind of kick in the pants when they need um, to be more disciplined and follow the, follow the plan. With my clients, at the end of the day, I really want them to walk away from training with me um, saying that they learned something and they had results. Um, sometimes a lot of my clients stay with me for a long time. Um, and they always uh, come back and say that they learned a lot, they got a lot out of it, and um, I also have reviews online from a lot of my clients, and 99% of them are very positive. So that, that means a lot to me that they get uh, their money's worth.